Hello everyone, my name is James Ryan and I am here to play for you, L.A. Noir. Now we are going to interview um, Mrs. Black. Not Adrian Black, jeez. Uh, Mar name, Margaret Black. Can observe the suspect. Eyes brown, age 30, hair black, sex female. Description, wife of missing person Adrian Black. Hmm. Let's ask her about the slaughterhouse you found receipt. The receipt in the trunk of your husband's car for a live <coughs> pig. This receipt was made out to an F Morgan. A pig? Adrian runs a tool business. That would be Frank Morgan. God knows what he's up to. Person of interest updated. Oh, I, I don't know whether she's telling the truth or not. I guess you just said, so I'll do this. Let me listen in with my headphone. Let me just press it against my ear so I can hear if I get it. If I get this right. What makes you say that Good, I got it right. Family. He's the foreman at my husband's plant. Very shaky character. Oh, I dropped the controller. He needs to keep his distance from the staff. They're always out drinking together. Coolio. Let's ask her about Kavanaugh's bar. That's an easy one. Your husband frequents Kavanaugh's bar? How did you know that? Adrian practically lives there after work. It's the same face, so she's telling the truth. So Adrian spends a lot of time there? Up until recently, he's been away in Seattle a lot on business. Hmm. Let's get an alibi so we don't so we know that you weren't involved. I think you should come clean with us, Mrs. Black. Your husband is missing, and after our search, I'm willing to call the circumstances suspicious. Can you account for your movements last night? You're not accusing me, are you? Oh, what an awful thing to say. I was here all night, of course, waiting for Adrian to come home. That same truthful face, yep. Is there anyone who can vouch for that? Well, no. I, I was here alone. I cooked Adrian's dinner and waited, but he never came home. Oh. Alright, let's talk about the stencil glasses. Was your husband wearing his glasses when he left here yesterday? Yes, he just bought a new pair. Yep, same truthful face. Go on. I kept telling him to throw those old ones away. He tried to repair them with tape. It looked terrible. Did your husband tell you where he was going last night? All he said was he was going to meet Frank for a drink. What did she say? Looks like the same truthful face though, but I want to check the log. Um, did your husband tell you where he was going last night? All he said was he was going to meet Frank for a drink. Alrighty then. So nothing out of the usual then. Well, he came home early from work. He never comes home early. And he went out early too. He normally never leaves for the bar till about seven. Mm hmm Let's ask about Nicole, eh? You've been truthful so far, but I think this one might put you off a little. Perhaps. Tell us about the photo of Adrian in the bedroom. What is there to tell? It's from his most recent business trip to Seattle. Yeah. Somehow I doubt that, or um, I think that's a lie, actually, I don't even doubt, I think it's a lie, but uh, just to check, do we have the evidence? Um, okay. Concealed message. But she, would she know about that? Doesn't matter, it's a lie anyway, so. There's plenty to tell. You just won't tell it. You're lying about the photograph, Mrs. Black. You're 
incredibly rude and insensitive. But I guess you know that. I've told you what I know about the picture. Unfortunately, we know you're not telling the truth. Because, uh, we have the evidence, the scientific evidence. What about Nicole, Mrs. Black? Was your husband going to leave you for her? I've seen the photo frame. <laughs> he thinks I'm stupid. But women sense these things. I don't know if he intended to leave me or if it was just a play. God only knows. I only want to know that he's safe. We'll keep you informed, Mrs. Oh, Brown. yeah. Six out of six correct. I hope I can get the whole case this time. Because uh, last time I think I messed up at the end, but I still managed to get him through a car chase. But if I got the question right, he would have um told me, rather than having me have to chase him. So, yeah. Oh, well. <clears throat> Let's go to the car. Hot cop, hot cop. Oh, Cole. You're getting in on the wrong side all the time. All the time. Let's go to Kavanaugh's bar. Jesus, I'm glad to be out of there. Mr. and Mrs. Black don't seem to have the habit Just using your driveway. Uh, so to divorce you don't too much of a shrinking violet to throw him out. If this hadn't happened, they could have stayed miserable together forever. I think she could have killed him. She sure as hell doesn't seem to type. Stranger things have happened. Sorry, I thought this was the road. That this is the road. There we go. Good. La 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 Got it, responded, dispatch call. Let's go. Sorry, official police business. What if that actually causes cars to be bad about way or not? Discovered landmark. Hall of Records. Oh, and that gave me experience. Cool. And I got an intuition point for that. Cool. Let's keep going. Uh, I don't think it really does anything, does it? In normal cars, it honks. Sorry, guys. Uh, but I'm on official release business so. here. And I have to get to, the dis to my destination quickly. So, yeah. <laughs> Keep LA safe. Drive safely. <laughs> Tough luck. I don't drive safely. I only tell people off for not driving safely. So, they have to drive safely. But uh, I'm a cop, and I tell people to drive safely, so that exempts Open me from the eyes. whole drive safely thing, I guess, somehow, in some way. No, I'm kidding, that would make me a hypocrite, but whatevers. Ah, uh, expert driving maneuvers here. Watch me not crash into anyone at all. Bam! There we go. And this thing is a, a long way away. That's okay. Wait. If I get my... Can I just get my partner to drive there? Or do I have to go there myself? Oh, I knew I should have driven. Can I get my partner to drive to really the scene? Starting to annoy me. Um, if it's a dispatch call? You can drive. Perhaps. But they might take me somewhere else. It might take me to Kavanaugh's bar. It's not where I want to go at all.